Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. So today I got something special for you guys. Uh, last week I went to my local hobby store and I bought a battery for the last project. However, while I was there, the salesman was like, hey, I see you like little cars. I have something in my car uh, that you might be interested in. So I tell him, okay, let's go check it out. We go to this guy's car and he pulls out this. I'm obviously new to the RC game when I was young I used to play with them all the time but then I went you know years without ever messing with one knowing about them I completely dropped out this guys is the team associated RC 18R and I've been using it for yeah for a couple days now and I absolutely love this car I am mad at myself for not knowing about this car sooner and realizing how amazing it was. Now, every time I go to a, a hobby store, they don't have any parts for it. There's nothing out there. There's a couple uh, aftermarket parts here and there. If you look up on eBay, you might find a couple things that are left over from somebody's collection, but everything's pricey. You can't really get anything for the original prices as they were before. Um, but you know what? It's okay. I absolutely love this thing. I hope that I can keep driving it for a long time and if I do break anything that I am able to just keep on repairing it and keep this thing going. So let me show you guys what this thing is equipped because it is such a fast little car. I never in my mind would have imagined that I'd be so in love with something so small. It, it's insane. Check it out. So here it is guys. This is the Team Associated RC18R. Now it does have a couple of hop ups. You'll see here, it's got a carbon fiber battery hold down, nice little blue tint. Uh, it did have the steel uh, dog bones uh, with wheel bearings. Uh, I saw that it has uh, new wheel bearings inside of it. Uh, it does also have, and this is why it's so quick, it's got a brushless system. It's a Castle Creations Mamba 2S. Uh, I'm not too familiar with it, so I don't know the technical specs of it. Um, I still have to look into all that stuff. Um, as I've said, I have been driving this thing and uh, it's so quick, I couldn't avoid hitting <laughs> the curb one time and I chipped the wheel. Also, I believe it was this one. Yeah, it was this one. The tire debeat it a little tiny bit and it flung out. You see it presses in flung out a piece of foam still pretty good there and then you get to here and it's just squish so it's half stiff half super soft but it's fine I'll uh, you know I, I bought some glue so I'll be able to put this thing back together uh, as best as I can to keep it going because like I said I absolutely love this thing um, so later on today I shall be taking this thing out and doing some speed runs because I know it's quick but I have not measured exactly how fast this thing's going um, if I had to take a wild guess uh, this is the battery that it's running it's a 2s uh, I'm gonna take a wild guess and say maybe like 25 miles per hour uh, is what this thing's gonna do um, but you know I, I'm not sure so we'll just have to actually go out there and test this thing see what it actually does you can see that it's a uh... yeah. all right starting at zero let's see what top speed is like this on this thing Okay, let's see those zeros. Okay, 
Round two. Let's do it. Why do I keep going over there? Okay. I was in full throttle. That was like three quarters. Yeah. We got 31 miles per hour. Jeez. I'm on the 2S battery right now. So when it has the 3S, it is faster. Mm -hmm. We're at 31 right now. Okay. So one last speed. One, one last speed run. Here yeah. comes my phone barely hanging on. <laughs> He's like, oh, ouch. Oh no, it broke. Uh, Look at the back tire. Oh shoot. Uh, uh. I backed it into it, which you think it was a safer, safer thing than the front. But now we actually got some damage. I think it will be fixable. Okay. I think I actually ended up cracking the chassis a little. See a little crack? And then this thing popped up. But I'm pretty sure I could just get the arm back in there. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Still moves though, which is funny. <laughs> Alright. And there you have it guys. 32 miles per hour for that little tiny car. Um, so yeah. I, I'll get it fixed again. I'll go back out there, try to do a redemption. Maybe I'll actually get a, a, a actual GPS, you know, unit, the little tiny guys, because I know the phone adds some weight, it throws things off and everything, but that's all I had for right now, so uh, that's the best I could do. Anyways, if you like the video, go ahead, drop a like, leave me a comment, any suggestions you guys might have, uh, how you're liking the videos, format or everything. I'm still trying to find my way around uh, how I'm doing this stuff. Uh, more than welcome to subscribe and yeah, hope I see you guys on the next one. It's so cold.